Understanding Rustle of the Bushes. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning channel. Today, we're going to explore a fascinating phrase that you might come across in books, movies, or even in everyday conversations. Rustle of the Bushes. This phrase paints a vivid picture through words, and understanding it can help you appreciate the beauty of the English language. Let's dive in and discover its meaning and use. Rustle of the bushes refers to the sound made by leaves or branches when they are gently moved by the wind, animals, or perhaps a human. The key word here is rustle, which is a soft, muffled sound resulting from light movement. When we talk about the bushes, we're referring to small to medium-sized plants with a lot of branches. So, put together, the phrase creates a sensory experience that's both auditory and visual, often used to set a scene or build suspense in storytelling. Let's look at how rustle of the bushes can be used in sentences. In literature, as she waited in the moonlit garden, the gentle rustle of the bushes told her she wasn't alone. In everyday language, I was startled by the rustle of the bushes, only to find it was just my cat exploring the garden. These examples show how the phrase can be used to describe a scenario, convey emotions, or even introduce an element of surprise. Understanding phrases like, rustle of the bushes, enhances your ability to comprehend and enjoy English language literature, movies, and songs. It's also an excellent example of how English uses sensory language to describe scenes and emotions vividly. By learning to use such descriptive phrases, you can make your own English communication more expressive and engaging. We hope you enjoyed exploring the meaning and beauty of the phrase, rustle of the bushes, with us today. Remember, language is not just about grammar and vocabulary, it's also about conveying images, feelings, and experiences. Keep an eye out for more phrases like this, and soon you'll find yourself appreciating the nuances of the English language even more. Thanks for watching, and see you in our next video.